Aloha Aina. I'm Ahuke Kahu Cartwell with the Kiwani Foundation here on Free Hawaii TV, a part of the Free Hawaii Broadcasting Network. Last week here on Free Hawaii TV, we told you about a nonprofit by the name of Kalo. Kalo was created by three individuals, one of whom is, well, can you guess? Kalo was created to shelter the assets of a Hawaii Island Charter School. And that in itself sounds okay, right? Yet, last week we reported here on Free Hawaii TV that Kalo has received over $22 million in funding from both the U.S. and also, can you guess? Now, if you're a charter school in Hawaii, it is normal that you will receive grant and government funds. But compared to the other charter schools in Hawaii, how much more funding did Robert Lindsay's Kalo get? That's right, Kalo received 17 times more money than any other charter school in Hawaii. Consider this. According to research in an article published by Hawaii Free Press, Robert Lindsay and former OHA trustee Oz Stender controlled the powerful OHA Assets Resource Committee for over 10 years. During that time, they disbanded the trustee budget and finance committee. They also did away with the office line item budget, making it impossible for beneficiaries and the public to do this. So we here at Free Hawaii TV have just one simple question for Robert Lindsay. But now, listen to this. During the tenure of Robert Lindsay and Oz Stender, OHA's annual budget exploded to this. And of that 40 million per year, can you guess how much money was allocated for actual beneficiary services? If elected, Mililani Trask will conduct a forensic audit of the millions of dollars that Robert Lindsay helped spend that did not go towards critical beneficiary needs, like housing, houselessness, education, job training, and health. Please vote Mililani Trask for truth and transparency this November 8th. Now, if you think this information is important, share this free Hawaii TV video with all your friends online. That's how you can support a free Hawaii. I'm Ahuke Kahu Cardwell with the Kiwani Foundation right here on the Free Hawaii Broadcasting Network.